A new technology is ripping through the financial world. According to the Financial Times, this new tech is taking over the front pages. Wired calls it a gold rush and Forbes calls it a once in a generation opportunity. Not only is this technology poised to become bigger and more influential than artificial intelligence, cryptocurrencies, and even 5G, it's moving much, much faster. I call this technology GTE, and as I'll reveal today, it could grow 48 times bigger than the entire stock market. Now, I know that sounds hard to believe, but GTE will help create a new way of life. It will change the types of houses and cars and investments that we can own and profit from in a way mankind hasn't seen for 400 years. So it's no surprise the world's smartest billionaire investors are all making their moves. The outspoken CEO of Tesla, Elon Musk, just invested in GTE. Billionaire founder of Twitter, Jack Dorsey, just made $2.9 million from his investment in GTE. The founder of Virgin, Richard Branson, is on board, and TV Shark Tank investor Mark Cuban just doubled down on his investment because he thinks this tech will dwarf Bitcoin. Well, Jeff, as big as those names are, we have to remind everyone that you are hailed as one of America's foremost tech investing experts. So for me to be sitting here with you again is a pleasure and actually a privilege. And for all of you tuning in at home, my name is Chris Hurd. I'll be your host today and am privileged to be so. I got to say, Jeff, it sounds like, based on what you've just said, all the big players are making their moves into GTE. Right. Well, thank you, Chris. And I'm absolutely thrilled to be here. And you are right. The smartest investors in the world are circling because GTE is set to overhaul the entire world economy. It will disrupt real estate, technology, energy, healthcare, and entertainment, and more, igniting the single biggest financial event since the birth of the stock market. The information in this document indicates we could be days away from the rollout. And if my estimates are correct, this technology will have an impact 100 and 13 times bigger than the internet, 600 times bigger than 5G, and 1,000 times bigger than cryptocurrencies. 1,000 times bigger. <laughs> That's pretty hard to imagine. I and know. especially, Jeff, when I think about all the fortunes that are being made in all of those individual technologies. So how big are we talking? In dollar terms, are we talking billions, trillions? Okay, well, think a little bit bigger, Chris. All told, $2.1 quadrillion is at stake. That's 48 times bigger than the stock market, which explains why the biggest players on Wall Street are diving in headfirst. Goldman Sachs, the world's number one investment bank, backed a company investing $400 million in GTE. Renowned investment bank JP Morgan just built a 100-person division dedicated to GTE. Andreessen Horowitz, the legendary VC who made a fortune moving in early on Facebook, led a 23 million dollar investment in this technology. Even the world's biggest stock exchanges are getting in. The NYSE just announced their involvement in GTE, and the NASDAQ reports GTE is finally ready and that it will transform the $440 billion global sports industry. And that's why super athletes like Michael Jordan and Kevin Durant jumped in, adding up to $305 million in investment. Even Tom Brady and Rob Gronkowski are involved. Now, according to Forbes, GTE could be the next big thing. Well, it, it certainly seems to meet the definition of big. But see, with all these billionaires and these hedge funds and the celebrities that you mentioned, with all of them lining up, is there really any room for average investors to profit from GTE? At the moment, yes, absolutely. What we're seeing is a reversal of fortunes unlike any in history. Almost every asset class in the world has been captured by Wall Street, right. and chances are that will happen with GTE too. But for the moment, there is a rare window for regular investors to get in. This year, companies involved in this technology have been showering investors in profits. Take Uniswap, which jumped 850% since just this January, or B20. It exploded from $1.72 per share to over $27. That's a 1,490% gain, nearly 16 times your money. 
And you could have bought shares of Rarible for a buck fifty before it skyrocketed as high as forty-two dollars. All right, so a buck fifty to forty-two. Hold, right. uh, give me just a moment here, because I know that it, the Nasdaq in a great year might be up what nine percent. But On what you're average, talking yeah. about, this seems like an entirely different animal altogether. So if I take that last example, yep. anyone who invested five hundred dollars yep. could have walked away with almost fourteen thousand. That all just happened this year. Yes, those are gains from this year. That's 2021. These are just a few of this year's big winners. And while it's no guarantee for how other plays will perform, it proves just how quickly this technology is moving. Early GTE investors are making money hand over fist. It's absolutely unbelievable. For instance, this year's shares of Ave popped as much as 682%. And I know this next one is, it's going to be hard to believe, but Theta made its investors as much as 179 times their money. Oh, man. That turns every $1,000 invested into as much as $179,920 in just one year, Chris. Every one of these is involved in GTE technology. As big and as exciting as these gains are, I'm even more excited for the opportunity that, of course, we're gonna discuss here today. Right. And we'll get into all of the details in just a moment. But imagine uh, a world IPO day <laughs> okay. where, where 20,000 IPOs all go public in a single day and then 20,000 more every day after that. Forever, Chris. Are, are you being serious here? <laughs> 20,000 IPOs in a single day? I know it sounds impossible, but uh, GTE will bring a $2.1 quadrillion dollar private economy online with thousands of IPOs every single day. Now, to be clear, I'm not talking about IPOs in the traditional sense. As I'll explain today, these IPOs are an evolution of the kind that you're familiar with. So soon you'll be able to invest in all sorts of things that were previously off limits to regular investors. Now in a moment, I'll show you how anyone with just $25 can invest in the private economy. Okay, $25, and GTE is the technology that's gonna make all of this possible? That's right, and the renowned consulting firm Deloitte says, the way we invest could be about to change with the arrival of GTE, but those who are not prepared risk being left behind. Now, we just saw how the NYSE and NASDAQ are getting involved. With this mad frenzy of IPOs opening up, they cannot afford to ignore it because this new market will absolutely dwarf the stock market, the bond market, and even the global currency market combined. It's incredible. Now, you just mentioned the private economy just a moment ago and the fact that it's about to open up. But yeah. Is that what you mean by private economy, bonds and currency? Actually, no. I'm talking about really a hidden realm of investing that's been off limits to most for centuries. Stuff that we could never imagine owning or making money from. And we'll get to some specific examples a little bit later. But the private economy adds up to $2.1 quadrillion, and GTE is unlocking all of it. Well, we can't wait to see how, and especially because you're saying that today's GTE investment is still on the ground floor. we got nowhere to go up but up from here, right? Well, that's right, Chris. And as we'll see today, the ground floor is where all of the biggest tech fortunes are made. So right. even though the GTE market has already seen 18 times growth so far this year, very few people know about it. I didn't know it grew that much this year, just in 2021. Yes, the World Economic Forum just held a tech summit announcing, get this, the arrival of the GTE economy. Now this technology could kick off weeks, even days from now. When folks look back years down the road, they'll wonder why so few saw it coming. But once you grasp what's really going on today, your financial destiny could change forever. Well, I can't wait to hear how that's even possible. And for those of you at home, you need to know Jeff Brown is one of the world's leading technology investors. So I would advise that we pay very close attention to every word he shares with us because Jeff has promised to reveal for free how we can all profit from the new technology that CNBC says is hot and getting hotter before it's too late. So. Grab something to write with also because Jeff has told me that he's going to reveal the names and tickers of a few GTE companies today. Right. No strings attached, right? That's correct. Okay. And, of course, that's the real reason that I'm here today to show you how to stake your claim before it's too late. And, Good. you know, sadly, most people are still going to miss out. As earth-shattering as this is, I'd be surprised if more than 1% or 2% of 
your viewers act on this opportunity today. Oh, gosh. Well, I, I hope it's going to be better than that. <laughs> Me too. But I've seen it, Chris, time and time again. People who knew that Amazon was onto something big, but they waited for years, yeah. missing the lion's share of the profits, all while they knew it. They knew it was a grand slam. Many of them were even using Amazon services. They understood the value of the company. Google, uh, Netflix, Apple, the same story. I really feel compelled to come forward and say it. So folks, don't look back years from now wondering how they missed it. Yeah, you've touched on something there that's important. I don't want to take that too lightly, Jeff. Your experience, I need to say this, as a tech executive and as an angel investor, that experience has led you to spot some of the most lucrative technologies of the past decade, right? In 2015, uh, I'm going to share this with everyone in case they don't know. You, in 2015, issued an alert to buy Bitcoin when it was trading for what, about $240? $240, that's right. This year, it blew past $60,000. That is a staggering 26,000% gain. So anyone who followed your advice and got into Bitcoin could have turned every $1,000 into $262,000. I think about that. It's amazing. Mm. The very next year in 2016, you spotted the chip maker NVIDIA. It was trading then for $24. Shares exploded after that, up 3,006%. It became the number one stock of the year based on return. The next year, in 2017, you did it again with uh, AMD this time, AMD. which not only topped the NASDAQ 100 in 2018, but did it again in 2019. That one uh, specifically is up as much as 793% since the Jeff Brown that we all know and love first recommended it. <laughs> and then again on March 17th, 2020, this was last year amidst the peak pandemic hysteria, you made the bold call. You advised your readers, hold your positions. I want everybody to take a look. Take a look at this video here. We're gonna pull this up for everybody. To see. Okay. And most importantly, things are absolutely going to get better. I believe that we're uh, in one of those windows that will be probably the best opportunity to make investments over the course of the next decade. Three days later, that stock market began a historic bounce back, surging to all time record highs. And since you filmed that video, mm. the S&P 500 is up over 45%. And then just last year, your recommendation on Infineon shot up 121%, Taiwan Semiconductor soared 187%, DocuSign, DocuSign yes. skyrocketed 432% since you first spotted. I could go on and on about the recent past, but the point here is that today, you are telling us that you've discovered a way for investors, and we're talking about regular folks, just like yours truly, <laughs> you're showing us how to profit from an explosive new technology. Absolutely. Okay. And in a moment, I'll reveal how just $25 cuts you in, how this technology could bring a $2.1 quadrillion private economy online, and the easiest way to position yourself for a massive win. Okay, you've mentioned quadrillions of dollars a couple of times now, and that makes my head spin. Thousand percent gains. Mm. Obviously, these are some huge numbers that we're throwing around up here. So, Let's get serious. What exactly are we talking about here? Tell us what GTE is. Mm. What is this private economy you're talking about? And why are so many people from billionaires to star athletes so interested in all this? These are all important questions. And today I'm going to answer all of them. What's happening right now in 2021 is something the world really hasn't seen for over 400 years. What's about to occur will be talked about for the next century or more. The change GTE represents is absolutely earth shattering. And I know this might sound odd, but to understand really how big this is, how much money you could make, we really need to step back to the canals of Amsterdam in 1602. Okay, okay. What, what <laughs> happened in Amsterdam? Well, in 1602, the world's first stock was born, and that was the Dutch oh. East India Company. You've okay. probably heard of that. Yes. Before then, no one knew what a stock was. The bulk of global wealth was private until one simple idea changed the world overnight. Let's split up our company into small pieces and sell them to investors. Now, of course, we take it for granted now, but 400 years ago, this was a technological breakthrough. It was the first time in history someone could own a fractional piece of something. Yeah, what a bit of history that was. So I get how fractional ownership, I see what you're saying. That was innovative back then. Mm. 
But again, what does that have to do with today? How can that idea make investors money today? Well, instead of just thinking about stocks or equity, GTE is allowing us to apply that simple idea, owning pieces of things mm -hmm. to the entire world. Because this technology allows almost anything on earth to become tradable, like uh, this Michael Jordan rookie card or this Picasso painting, even this $2.5 million Kentucky Derby winning racehorse. So someday GTE is going to let regular people invest in stuff like that? No, not, not someday, Chris. They're already thousands of investors who each own small stakes in all of those. 4,200 people own that horse. Even crazier, you could have bought part of it for just $206. Now, according to the Wall Street Journal, GTE opens up a world where you can buy stocks, bonds, derivatives, cryptocurrencies, or even pieces of arts all on one 24 by 7 exchange. Okay, so I want to be clear about this. Mm. You're saying that GTE is going to take a whole new world, as you put it, of investments public, similar to what it's like to trade on the New York Stock Exchange? Yes. Now imagine a world where just about everything is publicly traded. Every car, every restaurant, every work of art, every piece of real estate, every software program and new technology that's developed. Imagine being able to take a direct stake in anything. What we've seen so far is the first wave hitting the shores, but there is a quadrillion dollar tsunami behind it that hardly anyone is paying attention to. And that, Chris, is the opportunity that I'd like to focus on today. Okay, I'm, I'm with you so far, I think, but mm. this is not gonna happen on the stock exchange. We're not talking about the NYSE or NASDAQ or anything. It's right, this is a different. completely new market. Okay. And it's bigger than anything we've ever seen in our lifetimes. In fact, we haven't seen anything like this since the world's first stock went public in 1602. Okay, so I understand now why you're <laughs> saying we're on the brink of something big here. How's it gonna work? <laughs> well, first of all, it's not big, it's massive. And we can think about it like this. Anytime you buy a stock, you actually get a digital certificate that proves you own a piece of that publicly traded company. Right, so all the stocks in my retirement account, they have these digital certificates. Well, most people don't realize it, but we do. And something similar happens when you invest through GTE. But instead of getting a certificate, you get a digital proof of ownership called a token. Mm -hmm. And Chris, that's what GTE is all about. Something experts call tokenization. Now, Forbes wrote, in the future, everything will be tokenized. How far into the future are we talking? While experts were expecting this to take until 2025 to ramp up, you may be surprised it's actually happening right now. Hmm. On April 21st, 2021, a syndicate of 250 high-powered lawyers from New York, London, Paris, and Washington assembled to declare tokenization, the revolution is now. And a recent meeting hosted by the Chamber of Digital Commerce proved it. Our own SEC chairman, Jay Clayton, right. went on record saying this, our door is wide open. If you want to tokenize investments in a way that adds efficiency, we want to meet with you. And as a member of the chamber, I should tell you, this is huge. Clayton even went on to say, in time, everything will be tokenized. Right, and Jay Clayton is no small fish. <laughs> no, and that's from America's highest ranking official on trading regulation, and he's not the only one. The head of a Hong Kong Fortune 500 said, tokenization is really a massive trend, a much bigger story than cryptocurrencies, ICOs, and even blockchain. And seven out of the 10 of the world's largest banks have publicly announced tokenization initiatives now, we'll get into the details in a moment and how to position yourself to profit, but at its core, here's what tokenization means. In today's world, most assets are tied to just one owner. Right. But in the world of tokenization, you can split any asset into an infinite number of pieces. Thousands, even millions of people could take tiny ownership stakes in almost anything. Yeah, this is really fascinating stuff, Jeff. And I'm guessing, I should have asked you this before, tokenization. <laughs> Is that the T in GTE? And if it is, what, what do the other letters stand for here? Great question, Chris. GT, yes, it stands for Global Token Exchange. Exchange. And it's okay. the technology that powers the creation and transaction of these digital tokens. 
In the coming weeks, trillions of dollars could start pouring onto this digital exchange, up to 20,000 IPOs every single day, and just $25 lets you profit from all of them. But here's the thing, Chris, we aren't looking for the best IPO in the bunch or any individual investment on this exchange. Well, I'm glad. I was going to say it sounded like it could be a nightmare. <laughs> exactly. I couldn't even work through that many yeah. IPOs. <laughs> Instead, there's a way to own a piece of the entire exchange and profit from all the transactions on it. Very few people even know this is happening. Fewer still know how to profit from it. Right. Well, we know that you are not like most investors <laughs> because you were right on the money more than three years ago on this. I know that on June 18th, 2018, you wrote tokens will take over Wall Street. Real estate, gold, oil, art, classic cars, anything that has value will be tokenized and traded on token exchanges. And you continued, what if you could own Empire State Building tokens? Or 1937 Bugatti Type 57S <laughs> hot rod tokens? That's the world we're going into. Jeff, you've made a lot of accurate predictions. I know that better than anybody, but this is almost scary, really. Just recently, JP Morgan announced they're gonna to be tokenizing gold bars. Uh, Bloomberg, I think, has reported that you can tokenize a building. And you called this years ago. Can I ask, when did this really start to take off? Well, even though I knew this would be huge in 2018, it hasn't started heating up until really just this year. Mm -hmm. And that's great news for anyone looking to invest because we're still the top at the first inning right now. Yeah. So soon you might be able to pick up a few square feet of a penthouse in Bangkok or a ski resort in Colorado or a golf course in Hawaii. It, it, <laughs> it still kind of blows my mind. I still feel like this is something that's years into the future. Not at all. I mean, Fortune magazine says anyone with a few thousand dollars can play tycoon and buy a part of a condo or an iconic building. One company called T0 already started tokenizing $300 million of commercial real estate. And anyone who put $5,000 into T0 last year could have cashed out with as much as $38,540. Wow. It's almost eight times your money. And all without touching any actual real estate? Exactly. And that's the key, Chris, because for most people, owning a piece of prime real estate is a pipe dream. Mm -hmm. For centuries, properties like this French estate have been totally untouchable. But with tokenization, investors can buy directly into real estate like this for less than $100. You don't even need to leave your couch. Real estate in France, you are kidding me. No, I'm not. The Wall Street Journal published this headline saying investors can buy a share of this castle for as little as $60. But it doesn't stop with real estate. Imagine buying 3% of this beautiful 1968 Shelby Mustang or Paul Newman's one of a kind Rolex Daytona watch, a cut of this rare Muscovite gemstone or a piece of your favorite sports team, and then selling your stake instantly from anywhere in the world with a few taps on your smartphone. The big four accounting firm Deloitte said tokens could unlock trillions of dollars for regular investors, allowing you to buy into fine art and real estate for just $50. Well, my head is still spinning, but for the record, I'm in on that 1968 <laughs> Shelby. I'll take a piece of that one for sure. Yeah. Jeff, this has got to be one of the biggest investing stories of the year. Well, Chris, when you're finished here today, you'll see why this could be the biggest story of the century. Mm -hmm. Wherever this trend goes, enormous profits are sure to follow. Take sports. Earlier this year, the NBA partnered with a token company called Dapper Labs. Now, if you'd invested in January, just one share would have cost you $6.94. By March, Dapper traded over $39. That's a 465% gain. It's enough to turn every $1,000 invested into $5,654 in just six weeks, Chris. Six weeks. Absolutely mm. incredible. But now for folks who missed out on those gains, I think the point you're making here is that an even bigger opportunity is just ahead. Well. For context, we're in the opening seconds of what insiders call the race to tokenize everything. But as tokenization allows the $2.1 quadrillion private economy to go digital, things are going to start moving even faster. And really, that's why it's critical to get in now. And in a moment, I'll show you how anyone can own a piece of the entire global token exchange for just 
$25. Right. I, I chuckled because you used that word quadrillions again, and mm -hmm. I, again, it blows my mind. Is it possible? Can you even explain how something can be, would you say, 48 times bigger than the existing stock market? Well, I know it sounds crazy, so why don't I just show you? Here's a standard NFL football field. Okay. So do you see that little square there on the top? That represents all of the money in the stock market, all of it. Well, if that's the case, then mm. it's tiny. I mean, that can't be bigger than the size of a typical watering station. Well, you're not wrong, but here's the exciting part. Every day, billions of transactions fly across the stock exchange. Most people focus on picking the right stocks, but what if you could take a small piece of every trade? How much money do you think you might make? I, I can't imagine, but Jeff, something mm. you just said I, it dawned on me. This would be like owning a freeway toll booth. Everybody would have to pay you something on every trip they take down the expressway. That's exactly right. And that's the beauty of today's play. One investment lets you own the whole exchange. So instead of making dozens of different investments and praying each one of them goes up, one investment lets you profit from every transaction all on a field that's 48 times bigger than the stock market. Right, so if that little square is the stock market, mm. is the private economy, what we're, the rest of the field is the private economy. Well done, and the sad truth is that most Americans have been told the stock market is the only place to build a real retirement. Now, of course, I love the stock market. It's right. made me a lot of money, but compared to the private economy, the stock market is a drop in the ocean, and. Really, that's why I'm pounding the table on tokenization. It's going to let everyone profit from that private economy, and it's going to open up unbelievable investments to you in the months ahead. Okay, it's starting to click for me, I think. Can you show us how the private economy works? Absolutely. So let's see this 180 trillion. That's one private economy. And this 360 trillion, another private economy you've probably never seen. This quadrillion dollars here, yet another private economy the elites keep to themselves. Right, absolutely incredible. And most investors never get to profit from these markets, right? N never mind profit, most investors don't even know they exist. Mm. Fewer know how to get their money into them. Now, I, I know this seems like a lot of money to hide, but here's one of Wall Street's dirty little secrets. For most people, 99% of investments are completely off limits. That all changes weeks, maybe even days from now. Just consider the fortunes made in the stock market alone. Now, that tokenization is paving the way for 48 times more money to go public, and so the profit potential is absolutely staggering. Now, I'm trying to imagine, <laughs> trying. Well, Chris, th you know, this simply wasn't possible until every one of us had the chance to own tokens, which is why tokenization is the single most important technology to understand today. Until now, most investors have never had a fair chance to make the money that they deserve. Forbes says tokens give the average investor an opportunity to access investments in assets that are the domain of wealthy collectors and high-end auction houses. Jeff, this seems absolutely amazing mm. for the little guys, uh, our, us investors out there. It's normal guys on Main Street, but for the average investor, isn't the stock market already confusing enough? I mean, if I can literally, if you're, what you're saying is correct here, I can literally buy shares of anything, where am I supposed to start? Well, that's the beauty. You don't have to pick. Today's easy investment gets you a piece of the whole exchange right. for just $25. Th think about it like this. Imagine owning the toll booth on a private roadway. Everyone who passes through has to pay a fee. All you have to do is kick back and watch, and as the traffic flows, your wealth grows. That's the kind of opportunity you can look forward to today because when quadrillions of dollars begin moving onto this digital exchange, it could drop a giant payday in your lap, all from one buy and hold investment. Yeah, so basically what you're talking about is simplifying the entire thing. All you got to do is buy and hold. Well, without a doubt, Chris, this is the greatest buy and hold opportunity I've seen in my 36 years of investing. No complicated trades, no options, and no volatile penny stocks. And you can get started with as little as $25. All right, so with all of this money that's mm. going to be flowing online, I have to ask this question. 
is this technology that we're talking about, is this a cryptocurrency like Bitcoin? Well, Chris, I certainly love Bitcoin. I know you know that. But this year, prices have soared above $60,000 a coin. Right. That puts it out of reach for most investors. And I'll say it again, tokenization is not a cryptocurrency. It's a technology. And it's the single biggest innovation in the history of money. And that's why the CEO of State Street, the renowned investment firm with $40 trillion of assets said, the financial industry is transforming into a digital economy. Okay, next question. And I've, I've been hearing a lot about the NFT craze oh, a lot good. recently. So if this technology isn't a crypto, are we talking about NFT? No, NFT or non-fungible tokens right. are just the smallest, most recognizable example of tokenization right now. But since it's so hot right now, later in today's presentation, I'll actually reveal a simple way to profit from this lucrative trend. Good. But still, as a whole, NFTs are worth about $2.5 billion, a tiny sliver of what tokenization will become. So Chris, look here. The global token exchange could open an opportunity 1,000 times bigger than cryptocurrencies and NFTs combined. With all the crypto fortunes we're hearing about, imagine, just imagine what's possible with a pool of money 1,000 times bigger. Yeah. It's mind-boggling. And another reason that I don't take any of this lightly that you're sharing with us, Jeff, mm -hmm. is I know that you discovered Coinbase, the world's number one cryptocurrency exchange, years before its recent IPO. So am I allowed to ask, what kind of gains did you see from that? <laughs> well, it was <laughs> roughly 57 times my original investment, Chris. Wow. And I should point out, I earned those kinds of gains from an exchange, thousands of times smaller than the one I'll recommend today. That's the power of owning the toll booth, as you said earlier. Mm -hmm. With quadrillions at stake, it's no surprise the world's richest investors are circling. Jack Dorsey and Mark Benioff, the billionaire founders of Twitter and Salesforce.com, are both invested in tokenization. Mark Cuban, Richard Branson, Elon Musk are all invested. And as Cuban says, you only need to be right once to get rich. And Unlike him, you don't need to start and sell a billion dollar company for a shot at massive profits. Right, and you think that getting it right could take as little as 25 bucks. I do, getting started takes just minutes and the easy strategy I'll reveal today won't just get you in alongside the world's smartest investors. Entire countries are throwing their full support into tokenization. Switzerland is adding tokenization to its own banking infrastructure. The Australian Securities Exchange expects to adopt digital tokens by 2023, and France's central bank governor is watching tokenization with great interest. Even the cowboy state of Wyoming is gearing up. U.S. state of Wyoming defines tokenization as a new asset class, said Forbes. Wow. So with that kind of global interest out there, this clearly is not a fad. This is, this is here to stay. It is here to stay, Chris. But of course, Governments always move a step behind the markets. True. So by the time tokenization weaves itself into the fabric of our society, most of the profits will have been made. That's why it's so critical to get in right now. Yeah, you just made a good point. And coming from anybody else, I'd probably <laughs> still be a bit skeptical. You're not just another talking head here. You know, I was looking at your resume mm. before we started today, and I was reminded just how intimidating <laughs> not your education. In, not intimidating. Well, on paper, it really is. But mm. I, I, think about this. You've got degrees and certificates from MIT, uh, Yale School of Management, UC Berkeley School of Law, London Business School, not to mention the, uh, the famed cradle of astronauts that you've told us about, Purdue University, which yes. educated 24 U.S. astronauts, including Neil Armstrong. Well, and I'm, Chris, I'm not finished. Harvard's next on my list. Oh, but. really? <laughs> but see, here's my point. You, you're not a classroom mm -hmm. academic, and I mean that as a compliment. You're Definitely not one of not. them. You actually worked as a high-level executive at two public tech companies, first at, at Qualcomm, than as the, uh, the president of NXP Semiconductors, Japan. So you've got some extensive experience in technology, practical experience that's taken you all over the world, including the offices of, of several high-ranking policymakers. You've met with members of the Department of Commerce, the National Institute of Standards and Technology, NIST, the uh, Financial Services Committee, the DIA, Defense Intelligence Agency. We got a picture of you here at the Pentagon. Uh, <laughs> that was a fun trip. Yeah, uh, you're, you're a sitting member of the Chamber of Digital Commerce. I think you mentioned that earlier. 
you have established yourself as one of the most trusted technology experts in the world. I mean, who haven't you met with? Well, as much as I enjoy educating policymakers, there's quite a few entrepreneurs I'm still interested in meeting. Uh, Elon Musk, for example. Yeah. But uh, well, you know what? Let's can we talk about the private sector for a mm. minute? Because what's probably most impressive is your consistency in seeing lucrative tech trends years before they explode. Mm. We saw earlier, we talked about how your readers could have scored gains as high as 26,000% on Bitcoin, 3,006% on NVIDIA, mm. but I also know you've been on the ground floor of 100 plus companies as an angel investor. Well, Chris, it's actually over 200 now. I, I stand corrected, <laughs> sorry, 200. So I'm curious though, how did you first become interested in tokenization? How did that happen? Well, I've been following tokenization since 2015, and I know it doesn't sound like it's too long ago, mm -hmm. but those were the Wild West years of this technology. I was zigzagging across the continent, flying to so many conferences, I actually lost count, but it was a chance encounter with one brilliant CEO that led me to discover today's World IPO Day opportunity. By 2017, I realized the internet had huge ownership problems, in short, too few players had way too much control. Mm. Companies like Google and Apple and Amazon and Facebook had grown into the modern day royalty at the expense of the everyday person. I knew tokenization could shift some of that unchecked power back into the hands of regular investors. And I knew it was destined to open up a universe of investment opportunities. But until I met that CEO at a conference in Toronto, in 2018, I never realized it could happen so soon. And that CEO ran a company called Polymath. And when he showed me how his proprietary technology could take real estate, art, collectible, cars, jewelry, gemstones, and turn them into digital tokens, I knew tokenization was going to change everything and make early investors incredibly rich. Three years later, things exploded faster than either of us could have ever predicted. And even more amazing, what we're seeing in 2021 is still like a tiny snowball that just got rolling. Now before long, tokenization will be a massive force moving at a speed nobody can stop. And that's why it's so important for investors to make their move now. Fascinating story, thanks for sharing. And I know you want to keep coming back to this, but let me ask again, why is it so critical for people at home and yours truly to make their move right now? Well, Chris, you know, I cannot say it enough. You could very well look back on your decision today and whether you took action is the moment that changed everything for you and your family. Now, I know this sounds bold, but this technology is moving at rocket speed and waiting even a few days could mean leaving big gains on the table. And that's why we're starting to see celebrity actors, musicians and athletes jump into NFTs, one type of digital token. Reuters said NFTs are hot. CNBC says NFTs are getting a lot of buzz from everyone, from celebrities to athletes to musicians are getting in. And Entrepreneur Magazine says we're seeing an NFT gold rush. Major U.S. brands like Playboy, IBM, Taco Bell, and the NFL are getting involved. Yeah, those are massive brands. Why are they so interested in NFT? Well, it's actually quite simple, Chris. One word, money. With billions of dollars at play, everyone wants a piece. Just this year, NFT companies have delivered head-spinning wins to thousands of regular investors across America. Check out shares of Decentraland. It popped as high as 1,746%. Or have a look at Origin Protocol, which spiked 2,427%. Audius popped 2,458%. Red Fox jumped 1,527%. Shares of Ultra skyrocketed 556%. And shares of the NFT company Chili's skyrocketed as high as 3,528% this year, or 36 times your money. Now, you know, of course, there's no guarantees, and not every play will perform like these winners. But the fact remains, if you didn't invest in this market in 2021, you already missed some enormous opportunities. $500, just $500 into that last example would have turned into $18,140, Chris. Big numbers, and those gains all happened this year. Correct, but the NFT craze is just the beginning. It's the first ripple of a tidal wave set to unleash the most explosive 
profit opportunity of our generation. The bottom line is this, tokenization is here to stay, and if you want to make as much money as possible, you will never have a chance like this again. Okay, so if this is not going to be happening on an existing stock exchange, mm. how are people supposed to invest? All right, Chris, great question, and the answer is blockchain technology. Without it, World IPO Day would never be possible. Blockchain. You've been investing in blockchain yourself for quite well, a while now. since 2015. And as someone who's been in since the very beginning, I know it's not the easiest technology in the world to understand. Yeah. And the first thing to know is blockchain technology goes light years beyond Bitcoin. Now, you've probably heard of some of the buzz. Sure. Tech experts are calling blockchain more revolutionary than the cotton gin, the steam engine, the personal computer, and the smartphone combined. The Financial Post says blockchain is a bigger revolution than the internet itself, and Forbes declares it will usher in the next industrial revolution. Yes, I have heard about blockchain, and I know some very smart people who think it's going to be revolutionary, but if blockchain technology is the foundation of all of this, mm. does that mean that today's investment is tied to the price of Bitcoin, for example? No, today's play is not tied to Bitcoin in any way. You see, Bitcoin was simply the first application of blockchain technology. To say Bitcoin is the blockchain would be like saying AOL is the internet. So sure, AOL made a lot of money, just like Bitcoin has, enough to turn every $1,000 into $57,227. But AOL only made up 7% of the internet economy. So now imagine how rich you'd be if you could have invested in the entire internet instead of just AOL. I can't even imagine. Well, the answer is exponentially more, and that's how Bitcoin compares to blockchain. See, even though Bitcoin is up as much as 26,000% since I spotted it in 2015, it's still a smaller piece of a much, much bigger pie. It's incredible. So if blockchain can handle all of this commerce, mm. and I mean, we're literally talking about everything, everything. under the sun here, how are you so sure it works? Well, blockchain technology is like uh, Visa on steroids. Seventy percent of Americans have a credit card, right? Right. And Visa processes a whopping 1,700 transactions per second to keep up with our country's shopping addiction. Hmm. But Chris, guess how many transactions today's technology can handle? Oh, jeez. Uh, 10,000. 20,000. Well, Chris, the global token exchange is expected to process 1 million transactions per second. That's 500 times more bandwidth than Visa, the world's leading credit card company. According to the Wall Street Journal, this world computer can handle traffic from hundreds of millions of people around the world. Now, Chris, I cannot overstate it. The world hasn't seen anything even close to this since the very first stock went public in 1602. All right, and history is about to repeat itself. Without a doubt, the invention of this stock was no less of an innovation than the printing press or the steam engine, but it still had one giant problem. It took another 370 years for regular investors to get a piece of the action. By 1950, only 5% of Americans own stock, just 5%. It's Amazing. incredible. Centuries later, investing was still a rich man's game. The average Joe couldn't afford the fees, trading was slow, and his options were limited. But then something massive happened in the 1970s that changed everything. And what was that? Well, that's when the stock market went digital, because before the 1970s, every stock came with a little paper certificate like this one. But after 1973, these physical stock certificates went electronic. And in 1975, a landmark SEC decision finally banned expensive trading fees that stopped regular people from investing in the stock market. These two events triggered a 1,000% increase in trades over the next decade, which meant finally regular folks could win in the stock market. And as you can see here, <laughs> it happened very fast. It's very fascinating. I really had no idea about that kind of history. So are we at a similar pivotal moment now in time, you think? Yes, and it's much bigger. So you see, the 1970s opened the doors for millions of everyday people to finally start making money with stocks. Right. But this time, with everything from real estate to 
racehorses and cars going public with 20,000 new IPOs every day, it is exponentially bigger. The blockchain update outlined in this document indicates the rollout could begin very soon at a moment I believe could put early investors on the path to millionaire territory in record time. In just a moment, I'll reveal my number one play that makes you a toll booth owner so you get the chance to profit from every dollar moving on to the global token exchange. Well, Jeff, you've given us a very clear view of the future and shown us it is knocking right on our door right now. I do have one final question for you. Is this technology 100% proven to work? Yes. In fact, the world's largest central banks are already using it. The Investment Bank of the European Union just issued the world's first blockchain secured bond. And guess where the EU secured their $120 million, Chris? On the blockchain? Exactly. And the EU is trusting hundreds of millions of dollars on the blockchain because it works. The EU even issued a stark warning to countries worldwide that ignoring blockchain technology is economic suicide and nations are definitely listening. Other countries making moves include, include Canada, Switzerland, Chile, Estonia, Brazil, Singapore, Venezuela, Australia, and Japan, where as soon as next year, their stock market could move onto the blockchain. Really? The world's biggest nations are finally understanding what I've been saying for years, that this technology will single-handedly support the token economy, the economy of the future. And while the European Union accounts for $17 trillion in yearly economic output, their recent blockchain bond was simply a test run. Days from now, this update, titled EIP-1559, could send tokenization into hyperdrive on a global scale and start flooding the blockchain with trillions of dollars. So it is critical you take a position now before this update activates tokenization globally so you can take full advantage of every dollar moving onto the global token exchange. Jeff, I am so glad and grateful that we have you here explaining all of this to us. I never have these conversations. I said it earlier with anybody else. Mm. I always learn so much. And I know that you also have an army of people who are following your research. You have over one million people uh, who've subscribed to your daily tech newsletter. That's called the Bleeding Edge. Right. You've got another 240,000, almost a quarter million people uh, paying to receive your monthly tech stock recommendations. So my next question is, how can viewers out there right now get a hold of your pick for this event? Well, uh, the good news is my team and I just put together a special report that I'd like to give everyone access to right now. Great. It's called My Number One Easiest Way to Profit from the $2.1 Quadrillion World IPO Day. Sounds great. What can you tell us uh, about this report then? Well, of course. Uh, we cover every detail of this investment, including its name and ticker symbol why it's the easiest way to profit from the global shift to tokenization, and how to invest even if you don't have a lot of money to start. Right. You mentioned $25 is enough to get in, but what if people want to invest a little more than that? Well, that's the beauty of this play. You can invest as little or as much as you'd like, and yes, just $25 is the minimum to stake your claim. This report lays out all the steps in simple, easy-to-read details and requires absolutely zero investing experience to get started. Got to love that. So all we need is $25 and what, maybe a few minutes of time to potentially profit from all of this. Yes, I'd say five minutes of time to make your trade and the determination to act fast. You mm -hmm. see, when this update goes live, potentially days from now, $2.1 quadrillion could eventually be made public through digital tokens and anyone who owns a piece stands to profit from the biggest wealth shift in human history. Now, Chris, after 36 years in the trenches of technology investing, I've never seen anything moving this fast. Waiting even a few days could be the most costly mistake of your life, which is why I want to rush this report to anyone committed to learning how to profit from tokenization. All I ask in return is that you consider my monthly research service, the Near Future Report, at zero risk to you. Try it out for the next 60 days with no risk, and when you do, 
I'll immediately send you this report. Okay, sounds great. And as I understand it, the Near Future Report is actually your flagship research service. Can you tell us how it works? Well, absolutely, Chris. I call it Near Future because the future is coming much faster than we might think. Technology is moving so fast that it's tough for the average person to keep up. And by the time they hear about it from the mainstream media, it's already too late. Shares have already popped and the big money is off the table. And that's why most investors end up missing out on big investment opportunities. And that's where I can help. As you mentioned, I was a technology executive for 25 years and I've been involved in more than 200 deals as an angel investor. So over the years, I've built a network of very powerful connections in the technology space. And this allows me to spot the most lucrative tech trends months and as we discussed, sometimes years before they go mainstream. Right, and as we saw earlier, you predicted tokenization all the way back in, uh, in 2018, years before it was on anybody else's radar. And I think we actually covered some of your track record before, but it may be worth mm. repeating briefly here. You picked Bitcoin, got to say it again, right before it exploded as high as 26,000%. <laughs> That's enough to turn every $5,000 into $1.29 million. Mm. Think mm. about that. Mm. You picked NVIDIA as your favorite stock, I think, back in 2016, and shares exploded there, 3,006%. You recommended AMD in 2017 as your favorite stock, boom, exploded, up 793%. Then, I don't think we've mentioned this, when everyone was screaming to get out of Tesla, yes. you were actually pounding the table and telling people to buy shares of yes. that. And since then, the shares have jumped a split adjusted 1,155%. So with blockbuster picks like these, you really have established yourself as the go-to name in tech investing. In fact, many people consider you one of the top experts in the world. Well, that's my goal every single month inside the near future report. You'll hear about the most exciting tech and biotech investing opportunities as they hit my radar. And right now, our model portfolio has a hand in the most promising technologies of the decade, 5G, wireless technology, artificial intelligence, robotics, and electric vehicles, and as we've talked about today, even tokenization. Mm -hmm. That's why I'm including this next special report for viewers who act today. My next report is five turbocharged token companies set to explode ASAP. This special report highlights five tiny token companies poised to explode like fireworks as tokenization rips through every corner of the world economy. These are my favorites from five red hot industries with fast growing potential, including real estate, NFTs, digital collectibles, social media, and stocks. Now, you'll get the names of each company, my full analysis, and what I expect in the coming weeks and months ahead. You can invest in some of these now, some will be available soon, but all five are opportunities you absolutely must know about right now. These smaller, more speculative plays do carry more risk, and you should never invest more than you can afford to lose, but the upside potential of these tokens can be exponential. Right, and Jeff, you're also making this report free of charge for anybody who wants a copy. Correct, anyone who tries out the Near Future Report, my flagship technology investing letter, today will get a free copy of my World IPO Day report. Right, and your report on the five turbocharged token companies you mentioned. Right, Chris. Now, most people don't realize it, but we're at a critical tipping point. Investors who wait could miss out on the opportunity of a lifetime, and that's why I decided to put together another report for our viewers to score even more potential profits from this unprecedented moment. I love it. Tell us about that one. All right. Well, I'm calling this one your 101 guide to striking it rich in the NFT gold rush. Now, the NFT market has already seen 1,785% growth this year. So for anyone who wants to profit from the lucrative trend Forbes calls the NFT gold rush, this easy to read 101 guide gives you everything you need to know, including where to buy your first NFT, the three types of NFTs to avoid at all costs, Good. the number one cryptocurrency you need to buy NFTs, and how to sell your NFT at a profit and more. Uh, it's incredible. Jeff, you know, I have actually seen some notes that your readers have sent in. Okay. You have some true, devoted, lifelong fans. I want to read a few notes that have come in and just share them with our viewers right now. This one comes from Brian Z, 
who says, I have been a loyal subscriber for some time now and greatly admire and appreciate the work you do to bring us readers such quality recommendations. Your newsletters are well worth their weight in gold. Sandra M. says, I just wanted to let you know how much I appreciate the near future report. I find Jeff's observations very interesting. Well worth the subscription. Keep up the good work. Here's one from Kyle O., who calls your work a wealth of truly valuable information, very rare and hard to find. And one more here, Leonard S., who says, my portfolio is nothing now but Jeff's picks, and I am very pleased with how they are performing. Exclamation points. <laughs> Best newsletter printed, period. Keep up the great work. How do you react to that? Chris, nothing makes me happier than hearing from my readers because I do everything in my power to make the Near Future Report the number one investing advisory in the world. So I'm going to go one step further in making today's urgent offer a complete no-brainer. Viewers who join me today will also receive one final thank you gift. It's a unique strategy to allow anyone to take a stake in the exploding cryptocurrency market without paying a single penny in taxes. Now, I outline everything you need to know about it in this next special report, how to make a tax-free fortune with cryptocurrencies. Are you... Uh, <laughs> no taxes? No taxes. And I know this sounds crazy, but sort of. this special strategy is actually enshrined in U.S. tax code. In fact, hmm. this was the first tax-free token strategy approved by the IRS. So not only will I reveal which cryptocurrencies to buy, how much to pay for them and where to get them, I'll also show you how you can profit completely tax-free. Now, if you're interested in cryptocurrencies, this is the best way to start, but you can't hesitate because once the U.S. government realizes how valuable this is, there is no telling how long this tax-free loophole stays open. Yeah, you are a wealth of information <laughs> as always. And I just want to make sure that we're clear on this. Anyone who tries out the new, near future report today is going to get this particular report for free as well. Yes, you're going to gain immediate access to all four of the reports that I just mentioned. Okay, good to know. All right, well, so far we have covered a lot of ground, so let me take just a moment here to try and recap. This is going to be everything that you will get when you take this risk-free subscription to the Near Future Report. First of all, 12 months of Jeff's best investment ideas. That means that every month you're going to get a brand new issue of the Near Future Report with Jeff's top way of playing AI, artificial intelligence, blockchain, 5G, robotics, self-driving cars. Am I leaving out anything here? <laughs> All of the most exciting tech trends of our time. You're also going to get your number one easiest way to profit from the $2.1 quadrillion world IPO day. That's what we spent most of our time talking about here today. Bonus number one, five turbocharged token companies set to explode ASAP. Bonus number two, your 101 guide to striking it rich in the NFT gold rush. Bonus number three, how to make a tax-free fortune with cryptocurrencies. You're going to get access to Jeff's model portfolio. I love this, where you can actually see all of the current open positions. And you're going to get full support. That is Jeff's customer support team, which is located in Delray Beach, Florida. Please feel free to call or email them for any help that you may need with your subscription. Just remember, they can't offer any personalized investment advice. You're also going to get full 24-7 access to our members-only website. Jeff, tell me, how much does a one-year subscription run these days? Normally, it's $199 for a year, but today our viewers can access everything for just $49. That's a discount of $150, and it covers a full year of access. Yeah, so for a full year of access to your best ideas, we're talking... 13 cents a day. It's incredible. Well, and remember, you don't even need to commit for the year. You can just try it out risk-free and decide later if it's right for you. I told, That's great. You're really making this a no-brainer for anybody that's uh, tuning in for us right now. Let's talk about the risk-free aspect then. How does that work exactly? Well, it's simple, Chris. Anyone who joins today will have 60 full days to test out the service, follow all of my cutting-edge recommendations, and dive into the free reports that I mentioned, mm -hmm. And if during that time period you find that the information is anything less than life-changing or for any reason whatsoever you aren't totally satisfied, you can simply dial up our friendly customer support staff for an immediate refund of your full purchase. There are no questions asked. You'll get all your money back and we'll even let you keep everything you received as a subscriber 
at no charge at all. So there's really nothing to lose here. I mean, they can keep all four of the reports we just talked about. That's exactly right, Chris. Now, you get to keep all of the issues, you can keep all of the special reports, you can keep everything, and that means that there's literally no risk to you at all for this offer. To get started, uh, simply click on the button below. You'll be taken to another page where you can review everything one last time. And like I showed you here today, tokenization companies have been soaring this year. Rarible shot as high as 2,683%. Ave jumped as much as 682%. Uniswap jumped as high as 850%. Origin Protocol popped as high as 2,427%. Audius popped 2,458%. Red Fox jumped 1,527%. And Chili's shot as high as 3,528%. All of these massive gains happened just this year. I mean, just in the last example, had anyone invested $5,000, for example, just a few months later, you'd have more than $181,000. And now, as we speed towards the global shift to tokenization, I found the one investment that could capture the lion's share of profits. Remember, this could all go live days from now, bringing quadrillions of dollars online with the flip of a switch, which means there is no time to waste. Tokenization is already a foregone conclusion. And as you can see from these enormous profits, the technology is moving at lightning speed. Every second that we wait, we could be leaving huge money on the table. We simply haven't seen an event this massive since 1602. And it's because moments like these, when generational fortunes are built in a blink of the eye, only happens across centuries. This is one of the rarest moments in the history of investing and the world at large. Yet for just $25, you can take part of it alongside billionaires like Elon Musk, Mark Cuban, and Richard Branson. So please don't wait to read about this on the cover of the Wall Street Journal. By then, you'll have missed your chance by a mile. The confidence I have in my research is unshakable. And the only fear still in my mind is if you leave here today empty-handed. A decision I'm afraid you'll not only regret for yourself, but for your family too, because hesitating now could force them to wait centuries for another investing opportunity as big as World IPO Day. Today, right now, you can make the right decision for you and your loved ones. Please click the button below now to get started. And thank you so much for watching.